What is up everybody out there in YouTube land? I finally got my package in. This thing came all the way from, uh, let's see. Oh God, I don't know. Liening, Liening, something like that. Anyways, I ordered a few things, so I don't know exactly what this one is. But I know that it has to do with Mini Z. Uh, micro drifting all of that good stuff so what I'm gonna do is start by opening it up I don't know where to get started so let's just I guess start here on the side and like I said this took me a while I ordered it while I was on vacation a little while ago and I figured it would take a while because you know it's coming from really far place I just didn't know how it worked so I waited and waited and waited and now it's finally here so I know this isn't the best way to open this but I want to do it in a way to where we can see everything and open it like a normal unboxing instead of just dumping everything out you know what I mean there we go we got it we're there so when I ordered this, I ordered quite a bit of stuff, like I said. And this is what it probably all is. So, I got some bodies. These are some really cool bodies. This one is the... Uh, man, it's one of the bodies. But as you can see there, I don't know if the lighting's any good. Is that too bright? Let's, see, let's turn the lighting down. Maybe soften it up a little bit. Okay, so there's a body, here's a body. I wish you would tell me which bodies there are, but I mean, you can kind of see in there a little bit which body it is. Um, this is the uh, GL Drift um, deal. And I got it all on here because they had a bunch of cool stuff. I like Mini Z, don't get me wrong, I love Mini Z. But some of this stuff that they had going on here was really cool. I don't know if this is the summer edition. Oh, here we go. Two-wheel chassis drift 2022. I mean, this is the new stuff, guys. This is the new stuff. As you can see there. Hopefully you can see. Uh, kind of shows you a layout of what the body looks like. And this right here is... Let's see. This comes with a gyro, servo all of that good stuff but you do have to build it um this one is for drift and this is a new 2022 version and i know this because it does not look like the other one it actually has shocks and springs and doesn't have that weird spring on top that i don't like oh my god look at that body look at that body right there isn't that cool and oh here we go this is what i was this is the drift art summer edition this is the one that is super legit you guys look this thing up i mean it is just amazeballs you know what i mean this thing is really cool let me see if i can actually get it on my uh my computer here i can show you guys what it looks like because it's really cool Summer edition. Yeah, I want to show you guys a picture of this. It is a very cool. I mean, I'm talking like. Whoa. I'm talking like, dang, why, why did I never know about this? So, yeah, that's what it looks like. As you can see there, I mean, oh man, I keep dropping my phone. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm really sorry. But as you can see there, I mean, it's super legit. I mean, look at that. I mean, come on. Wait, no, that's something else. But you guys see what I'm saying, right? I mean, just looking at the front of that, I mean, look at that. I mean, it's fully detailed. Um... So yeah, back to that picture. That's what I got. I mean, it is just 
Legit, legit, legit. Dang it, dude. I'm dropping everything now. I hate it when I do that. Like, I'm just trying to do a simple little video. And I'm dropping stuff everywhere. Okay, so. And, of course, it doesn't come with wheels or rims or any of that stuff. So, I got a bunch of that, as you can see. They're all bagged up nice and nice and neat um here's all of my receivers looks like i got uh i actually started off getting dsm and then i changed my mind and i went with futaba so i'm not really sure doesn't say oh yeah dsm 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 yeah so I'm going to be putting these up for sale, unfortunately, yeah, because I'm not going to be using them. Here's a bunch more tires. Like I said, I ordered a bunch of stuff. And I did that. Here's Yokomo. I mean, just cool stuff. I did that because I wanted to make sure that I got what I need. Oh, and it come, came with a little tool. That way I can take the wheels off, put them back on. Um... You can see it has a little Jerift logo there. Um, does it say thank you for your support of GT55 gift for you? Thank you guys. I appreciate that. I really do. So yeah, so that's what was in that box. Let's toss that over there. So I got this. Um, the only thing that sucks... And I think I have it coming soon. But the only thing that sucks is that, again, these are DSM receivers. And I needed Butaba. So, um, whatever though. It's all good. You know what I mean? Like, I can definitely sell these online. Bunch of wheels. Look how cool those wheels look. You know what? Cool. I mean, and I mean, look at the Michelin. I mean... Yeah, some of you that have been doing this for years are probably like, oh my god, this guy, like, he's serious. You know, but the thing is, I'm new to this. I, I don't I don't know a whole lot about this. So, and I have more coming. Th this is two of the kits. Oh, wait, or is that all of them? No, I think I ordered three kits. But yeah, the only thing I'm missing, unless they're in here, is the Futaba receivers. So... So yeah, this is my my haul for today, you guys. Um, let's see if we can zoom in a little bit. There we go. And let's move this camera that way. So that way you guys can see again. Boom, boom. Um, I'm not gonna open this up just yet. Yeah, I have to build it anyways. So. And I, I'm pretty sure this one is not built. So I'm not going to open any of this up just yet. I want to kind of get myself, get my room put. Oh, let's see. This one we can actually open up, I think. Oh, from here. Three. So. Oh, and I forgot I got the, the programming card. So, yeah. So we're looking at a bunch of parts and stuff, and I mean, just everything in here. There's your servo, your receiver, just all the stuff that you're going to need. Oh, this is the receiver. Which receiver is this? If you guys want to see, that's what... Yeah, this is the brushless. So yeah, so there's the receiver for that. And um, yeah, so I definitely got my work cut out for me as far as for this stuff. Um, I personally think it's a blast. Um, I took a break from work a while ago after the death of my father. And I've just been kind of, you know chilling and stuff and doing things selling it online and is there tape on this or something and yeah i'm not gonna open that because every time i rush things i ruin stuff so um 
so yeah this is what I'm gonna be doing for right now is just kind of you know doing these things um, building stuff and you know and whatever and putting this all together I have a crap ton of mini Z stuff so kind of over the mini Z stuff so I wanted something different and definitely with these three kits we're looking at something different so and like I said the atomic it's not the same as the other one this one's actually a drift chassis and it's different looking um i can show you guys if you'd like let's see here we're going on 10 minutes on this video but let's see if i can find this um atomic drz2 and let's zoom back out here. I know, Kitty Kitty. Oh, come on. Why do you have to be on there? How do you get rid of this? Oh, that's annoying. So you're supposed to be able to see what it kind of looks like there, but for some reason... Oh, okay, so I guess that's the picture. But as you look, I, want, I wish they had a full chassis shot. But if you take a look, I mean, look at this thing. It's ridiculously, insanely detailed. Um, and what I don't like is like the uh, chassis that have the, uh, the spring. I think this is actually it. Yep, that's it right there. What I don't like is the chassis that have the springs in the middle here. I like the chassis that have the springs, the shocks, I should say, like actual cars. And that's what this one has. And so that's why I really like it. Um, let's look up the other one. GL Drift. That way I can show you guys what these things look like. Um, yeah, I mean, look at that thing. Come on, the pop-ups. Let's see if we can, there we go. Yeah, look at that. I mean, like I said, that's how I like it. I like it to look like a one-tenth scale car is what I should say. That's how I like it to look. Um, I don't like it to look, you know, cheesy with the one spring sticking out and it's just... I mean, it's not saying, I mean, a lot of you professional Mini Z drivers are probably going to be like, you know what, dude, you don't even know what you're talking about. And in a way, you're right. I don't super know what I'm talking about, but I know what I like, and that is what I like. Okay, I'll put that back together in a little bit. And as you can see, uh, we also have a cat here. Um, yeah, he likes to do this. Every time I'm doing something... For some reason he has to sleep wherever I'm working so so yeah guys that's it for today unboxing big haul all of that good stuff thank you for being patient and for watching this I really do appreciate it uh, Moki appreciates it too uh, if you want to send some love out to Moki definitely do that and uh, yeah all right guys oh and let me show you what I'm actually gonna be racing with this is my radio. I know it's kind of weird, but I don't care. It's cool to me, right? And that's everything that matters. Is it's cool to me. And just know, guys, if you pick this radio up, there's only it only goes up and down, left and right. It's not like a helicopter radio where you can move it around and do your thing and all of that stuff. It's actually, and it's cool because I've actually linked up um, cars to this radio. And the thing is, is that you you realize at the end of the day that you only need this and this. That's it. You literally, unless you're going to do mixing or something, you don't need the other stuff. So, this right here. And then not only that, but check it out. It's got your shoulder buttons. It's got your back buttons. It's got the, I mean, it's futuristic. It came out a couple years ago, but it's super futuristic still. You can update it. You can plug in stuff. You can do everything. It's got some button right here. I don't really know what that's for just yet. But yeah, 
and it has the same interface as the 7 px so i mean what 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 can go wrong there you know what i mean it's still pretty legit so all right guys well that's it for now take care much love be safe out there and um yeah let me know if you have any questions all right guys later